Yo, you know what I was hearing? Ashes to ashes, dust to dust. Um, there is some sort of death ray I'm hearing, but somebody feeling like they're about to be destroyed or this is what's coming towards them. Some sort of hell of karma is coming down on somebody. It's about to pour down on someone. Um, let's just jump into it. Let's see who needs this message. What sign needs this message? Oh, Aquarius and Capricorn. Should we take both or let's just do one? Let's do one. Let's see who needs this message to download. Ooh, Virgo. So somebody is feeling like they're about to be destroyed. This is some destructive ass energy. Um, <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Remember, this is where we keep it real and raw. I'll give it to you straight with no chaser. You think I'm a fake ass terror? Terror, you take your ass on up the road because I serve no cake here and nobody's forcing you to eat anime. But don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Let's see what's going on around you guys. You got a chasing energy. So, pursue toxicity, resilience. So, you got somebody around you that you probably have to get the fuck away from. Get. Get on up out of here. And karma is hitting their ass. Run, running. Ghosting, disappearing, invisible. So you have to chasing and running. You trying to get the fuck away from this person. I'm giving you don't even know if you're coming or going, Virgo. Longing. This is some toxic ass energy. I'm seeing that devil card. Um so you all could be dealing with a Capricorn. Somebody is obsessed. You got a conflict, realization, and thinking. Clashing. Differences. Thinking. Missing you craving desires. Realization. Infinite. Understanding and awakening. It's like you're realizing that this person is crazy as hell. You're realizing that... It's okay for somebody to really want to be with you, but when it turns into obsession, that's when it takes 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 a toll on you. It takes it too fucking far. That's when shit is going too far, when they can't eat, sleep, breathe without you. Because at the end of the day, you come in this world, don't you're going to die alone. So for you to be codependent on someone else, it has your fucking mind blown. You're, you're not understanding how this person is so obsessed and so... Um, wrapped up into you. That's what I'm getting. Give me more on this energy for Virgo. Clarify this energy for Virgo. I'm telling you, this night, it's like this night of passion turned into some, some, oh my God. Um, y'all elements, y'all love element in lifetime. I'm getting lifetime movie. This shit then turned into some creepy, weird obsession type shit, stalker type vibes. This person could be possibly looking in your goddamn window. Confirmation. Look at that confirmation somebody is stalking this is a stalker this is somebody who you have cut off multiple times possibly even relocated you didn't get about the jam multiple times but it's like this person keeps finding you or keeps running into you strange places it's like they just don't get it it's like this person just don't get it and yeah, yeah, y'all have fun. Night of passion. But you you quickly picked up on how crazy this person was. Again, you all could be dealing with a fire sign. Night of Wands. Uh, Night of Wands. King of Wands. Like this person possibly came off very, very strong. Um, independent. Like a leader. Boss daddy energy. Very secure. <laughs> yes, this person came off very secure. Like, they wasn't no jealous type person. Um, it was a facade. This, oh, it's something, it was something very dark about this person. It's like you couldn't put your finger on it, Virgo. It was something very, very dark about this person. Um, their eyes. I'm hearing it's their eyes. It's their eyes. You soon realize, uh-uh, that was, uh-uh, <laughs> the star card to the higher friend. There was no hope in this relationship. There was no longevity in this um partnership. Um, 
and this person ain't morally rap type, you realize that y'all are literally cut from two different cloths. And you don't know what type of cloth this person got. That might be that hot shit, that polyester. That shit that I don't, do they still make polyester? 5'11. Then you realize this person on some hot shit. <laughs> You are, you realize, and you possibly could have got pregnant by this person, Virgo, or are pregnant right now, currently. This could be the father of your child that you're running away from, or the mother of your child that you're running away from. Flip, the, flip and switch the energies. But you're realizing, even with this child growing in your belly, you realize it and you're replaying exactly what a, and it's not funny, but what you, what you went wrong at, it's, it's like, it's humorous as you think about it because there was so many red flags. There was so many things shown. But I'm telling you, <laughs> this night of wands was a night of passion, baby. That shit had you shaking. I'm hearing me shake, bed shake, rock, something like that on them lines or something like that because how'd you get here 622 how'd you get here virgo what your freaky ass was doing somebody was doing something but for sure <laughs> somebody was doing something because if you know you know <laughs> but you soon realized <laughs> you soon realized this person has some secrets. Got some secrets. <laughs> this person is in balance. Oh, no way. This I'm here mentally disturbed. There's a chemical imbalance. There's something wrong mentally. Like, really, this person is really loco. Like, really crazy, crazy. Could be expanding, because why did I just say local like that? Um, it could really be crazy. This could be his a uh, Hispanic person. Um for sure. Our, our brown people. Wow. Yeah. Somebody is like insanely crazy. Like this is like to the point where you all have to go get a restraining order type crazy. Or, like, this person will fight your new person type crazy, like, type shit. <laughs> Keep it a buck. Like, they can't see you going on to get no fucking victories. They don't see you moving on to get no fucking success without them. Period. Virgo, you got to protect yourself. Facts. Facts. This shit... You could have been like this shit could have been through the entire pregnancy. The yo, these last nine months have been hell for you for you. Literally. I mean, he didn't cut you down every which way. Do you see how these sticks? Some of them that it's only one stick is tall as up, but the rest of them been cutting, cut down and broken off. And it's like you got the last strong standing stick. The rest of them. They barely there. It's like he didn't cut you down so fucking low. And it's like you still trying to build yourself up. You still standing. But it's some areas of your life where you, you don't feel as tall. That's what it is. You don't feel as secure because of this relationship. Whoever this emperor, empress energy is, flip and switch the roles. Whoever this person is because he's coming out or she's coming out in the reverse. This person literally tried to control you and you allowed this history, this history with this person to keep you tied into their bullshit, this mental bullshit, manipulation, having you go back and forth with them for the last eight, nine months, whatever you've been doing. This back and forth ass energy keeping you bound on a dark shit. This person is something about their eyes, Virgo. Check this person's eyes. I'm telling you, their eyes will tell you the truth. They have very, very dark eyes, soulless eyes. They're deep and sunken, Virgo. These are some sunken. This person is very, very karmic. Yeah, it's time. 
for you to wake the fuck up, Virgo. Get the fuck away from this person. Protect yourself. Protect your child if you are with child. Yeah, you got to move on to karma waters. Because what they goal is to, they trying to keep you here. They don't want to see you grow. They don't want to see you in your essence. You like, you're a very beautiful person, Virgo. Very beautiful person. Like, this person really legit just don't want to see you give birth to anything. Rather that be a business co confirmation. Rather that be a business. Rather that be just, you just being successful in life, period. Just winning in life, period. They don't want to see that. They'd rather see you at the Five of Pentacles struggling, barely making it. They don't want you to be optimistic about life. This person wants you to be sunk. They don't want new love around you. They want you to be trapped by them. And placed on some sort of wall as a trophy. Never to be used again. Only to come over and to be dusted off every once in a while. Facts. Source of sin release that shit. I ain't finna keep playing with you. Source saying, least them burdens, because they ain't yours to carry. That shit ain't yours. This ain't got nothing to do with no damn Virgo. This they shit. This is literally their energy. You coming out just trying to be in your essence and give birth, be, be nurturing, be empowering to those around you. That's all you trying to do, enlighten those that can't see the light. Help them find a, find a light at the end of the tunnel. That's all you try to do with this person. Confirmation. But every opportunity, every chance they got, this person tried to break you down. Break you down. And they feel the ultimate how I got you is this baby. They feel that this baby, 1212, is what's going to keep you bound to them. For sure, for sure. What's the outcome for this situation? Damn, I can't get that out. It's time to tap in, Virgo. It's time to go sit by some water. Ground yourself. Self-care. You got to separate yourself from this person. And that means putting up the necessary boundaries to protect you and yours. So if that means you have to implement, implement the fucking police, do so. The court, do so. But you got to do what's best for you in order to survive out here because this person is crazy as hell. And the only thing they see is you. And they don't want nobody else to have you. But they damn sure don't really want you like that either. The sex was good. But this person. It's, it's just a trophy. I, I don't. Like you. you, you they want to keep you. But kept on the wall. I don't. Kept on the shelf. I mean. Again. <laughs> You are a jackpot, but again, this person just wants to keep you to themselves. It's something about all to themselves. They don't want nobody else to be around you. This person possibly could have, honestly, um, caused a lot of chaos and caused you to have these rifts with your family where or oh, made you move far as fuck away from your family. You're at a distance from your family, from your support system. Sources need you to get back towards your support system. You need to find support. If you are pregnant, find support. If you're not fine, if you're not pregnant, find support still. Find support to help you get the strength to help build yourself back up because you have a new opportunity that awaits you. But this is about really healing yourself, releasing this shit. These burdens, this depression, this depression, this anxiety. Releasing this dark ass energy because this ain't yours. It's a tower moment that's about to happen, Virgo. Things is about to change. No more lies, no more games. Things are about to change. This manipulation, shit is about to boom. I'm hearing a big boom. Like, you about to have a big 
relief. Like, I don't know what, what that is, Virgo. Somebody, you reap what you sow. This, whatever they have done to you, is coming back to them 10 times, Virgo. That download that I got of this person being um, like an extra, it felt like a laser beam being like, like on somebody. And it literally was burning the shit out of this person until they went into ashes. So again, ashes to ashes, dust to dust. It's something about this person has done something a little too much, a little too, went a little too far. And it's like, you chase you running and running away from this person they chasing you it's like you can't get away but source is finna put a roadblock right in front of this person this shit is finna halt they ass this ten of cups is not there for them source is finna stop this shit final thought Final thought for Virgo. Final thought for Virgo. Everything that you're doing, you need to keep it to yourself. And that means get the fuck off of social media. That means any and everything that's going on around you needs to be held tight to yourself. You don't need to be telling nobody your moves or plans. You need to be moving in silence right now, Virgo. Keep that ass guessing and wondering where you at. It's really about staying under the radar right now because this person is crazy. They trying to find you. And they they trying to make it a concern as if they're worried about this baby. But you got this baby. Your baby good. Find your support system, Virgo. Let's see what else is going on around you. What sign? Ooh. You have somebody born on the 6th, sun sign, <laughs> sun sign in Leo. That's funny. I, damn, I said that. Didn't I say that? Fire sign, sun sign in Leo. Um, oh, Somebody could be born August, August 9th. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I hope this message gave you some insight and clarity. Thank you for all your love and support. Namaste.